whenever a new car debuts, in almost all cases we get to see it on official images and then at a major auto show only in the highest specification with all the possible bells and whistles. From time to time, a handful of automakers decide to surprise us by revealing photos of a model entry-level trim, like at the case here with Mercedes and its fourth-generation A-Class hatchback. Riding on Gloria 16-inch steel wheels with hubcaps, the compact five-door model eschews the fancy full LED headlights for more humble halogen lights with light-emitting diodes only for the daytime running lights. Step up to the A250 model and it still has steel wheels in its Spartan setup, but the size is bumped by an inch. While the exterior might make some people say the car is and worthy of its premium status, the interior looks pretty sweet even in its basic configuration. The cheapest A-Class hatch money can buy comes with a digital instrument cluster, a 7-inch display accompanied by an infotainment system of the same size. Customers will have to pay more to get the top-of-the-range system boasting dual 10.25-inch displays or settle for less by opting for the mid-range version combining a 7-inch driver display with the 10.25-inch infotainment. The standard A-Class in Germany pictured here comes with fabric upholstery and a one-zone automatic climate control system, but it not exactly lacking in the equipment department. For example, it gets goodies such as cruise control, rain sensor, and selectable driving modes, while keyless go and a multi-function sports steering wheel are standard as well. It DOES and skimp on safety features either, with technologies like lane keeping, active brake, and attention assist included right from the start. For those willing to pay more, Mercedes has released images with the high-end A-Class in the AMG line flavor silver car and also a few photos depicting the hatchback fitted with the optional night package. The 2018 A-Class will be exhibited in the metal from Tuesday at the Geneva Motor Show and will be followed later this year by a US-bound sedan set to be positioned underneath the CLA.